All right. So everyone's always said, Doc, why don't you put an edging on your bed? Why don't you put an edging on your bed? <laughs> so uh, normally it's not a problem for me, but I'm going to go ahead today. And since uh, I got Jacob out here helping me, I can use him to do a lot of this labor because I got too much else to do. So I'm going to train him today to do this around a lot of the beds. But before I do that, I'm going to show you how I do it. So hold on one sec. Hey guys, so before we start, real uh, good news, Human Char is going to be running next week. It'll be up available hopefully in maybe about two or three weeks. I'll let you guys know. Um, if you're up north on a northern lawn, make sure you get your pre-emergent down. Usually April 15th is about the time for you guys. Soil temperature about 50 to 55 degrees and PGF complete. Yes, on fescue lawns, PGF complete. Use that as your spring fertilizer. <laughs> Gosh, hit subscribe because we got about eight videos coming. Only the good looking people get to subscribe, by the way. That's it. So let me show you. For years, I just run a natural edge. Basically, I pull the mulch back, I spray Roundup or weed killer, whatever. And um, that's how I keep my grass out of here. But this year, finally, I'm gonna go ahead and do it with a firm edge. And so what we're doing is I'm taking a spade and I'm cutting down two to three inches. Then we're taking this hammer and plastic material that comes in rolls and we're hammering it in. And then we're taking these uh, landscape blocks. Now, most of these landscape blocks, like these are from Lowe's, they're those small ones. And they run like a dollar thirty, dollar forty a piece. So it's pretty cheap, actually. I'll put links to this in the website. In the description below, I always link to everything I'm talking about. So I'm talking about pre-emergent, I'm talking about PGF complete, I'm talking about this. Click on that link, it'll take you over to page. You can find everything. Plus, if you need the Bermuda grass calendar, it's over there too. So uh, I'm gonna, today I'm gonna do a little bit myself. I'm gonna train Jacob on it, and then I'll show you guys what it looks like when it's done. So let's look at the semi-finished project. I gotta stop for, I gotta go do some stuff inside, but looking pretty darn good if I do say so myself. Now I got up to just about there. I had to stop, we're gonna go all the way back. But uh, liking it, looks good. So uh, Jacob had kind of a family issue, emergency to handle today, so he couldn't make it, so. I actually had to do some work. I don't like doing that. I'm getting too old. <laughs> Let me show you what we got done over here. And we're also going to be doing the back. And I'll show you next week when we do this back area, I'll show you the back too. So you'll be able to see both. You can see. I mean, comes out really nice. And here's the thing about this is that this will, the plastic hammer and border will stop the Bermuda from growing in because Bermuda gets everywhere will stop the Bermuda from growing in. And then you also have a nice, uh, not too big or too bold stone treatment here. And it just really pops, it makes it look nice. Now, one thing I will tell you is if you ever wanted to match your brick, like if you wanted to match the brick on the house, you could stain these a little bit, but they'll weather with time. We have them out back too. And if at all possible, <laughs> have Lowe's deliver them. If you're gonna get a whole bunch, Please, I want to show you the back. This is really looking nice. I mean, April 3rd. I mean, really. That's looking great. 
Now, on some of these areas, we'll probably just do the hard plastic border. We won't do the block, but let me show you over here. Uh, these are the, someone's gonna say, what are those lines on your lawn? This is the leveling, the rut leveling we did the other day. Video is up. This area back here is a large, so we're gonna do this area too. We're gonna do this whole area in the double edging. And bring it all around here over to the big vegetable garden. Look at, look at how thick this grass is right here. <laughs> look at how thick that is. That is golf course quality. That is gorgeous. I know, Doc can't stop admiring his own lawn, but I'm just telling you, putting down humichar, organic matter, along with the PGF Complete is just popping. This lawn is just bright, bright, or dark, dark green. <laughs> Matter of fact, we had uh, two neighbors I'd never met. They were talking about my front and I invited them out back and they went, is this painted? <laughs> no, this is just, there's no other lawn in the neighborhood looks like this. Just, we just got that early start going. PGF complete, man, with that high 3% iron, I'm telling you, it just makes it just pop. So anyways, hit subscribe, got a bunch of stuff coming. I'm gonna go eat some lasagna I just made. Yeah, baby. Talk to you later. Done.